Today we review Thank You for Smoking from 2005. This is for the twelfth week of Movie Club Strikes Back. Thank You for Smoking is a bit of a satirical look at politics in general, but specifically the tobacco industry. And it features uh, Aaron Eckert, he plays Nick Naylor, who is this big spokesman for tobacco companies in America. And then we have his son, Joey, played by Cameron Bright, and I think uh, Bright's performance in this was very good and it was like a believable father-son relationship to me anyway. And Nick Naylor's ex-wife is played by Kim Dickens. She is Jill Naylor. She now has another boyfriend. There's a funny incident between the uh, boyfriend and Aaron Eckhart's character, Nick. The movie is written and directed by Jason Reitman. I think the movie does flow well. Like I've said, when the writer is also the director, I think it has a better feel, a better flow to it because they know exactly what they had envisioned initially. The movie is really a political movie based around the tobacco, with a showing of the struggle between work life and family life, and how trying to balance both sometimes does not work out. There are some comedic bits in this. There is the Mod Squad, the Merchants of Death, which has Maria Bello playing Polly Bailey. She is the uh, alcohol spokesperson for moderation. And we have David Kostner. He plays Bobby J. Bliss. He is the gun advocate. He uh, is from Anchorman Champ Kind. And the whole time I just want to hear him say, whammy. But it doesn't happen. I think the movie does show well the way that politicians are able to talk around the question. And you get to see Nick show his son Joey how to negotiate or debate. And at the end, Joey ends up winning the debate competition, so that's good. The movie features a lot of people. Katie Holmes is in this. She plays Heather Halloway. She's the reporter. She ends up sleeping with Nick Naylor. And apparently once you get Nick Naylor in bed, he'll spill anything you want to know. So that ends up kind of biting him in the rear. But he's a great spin doctor and is able to turn it around still. We have J.K. Simmons in this. We have William H. Macy. We have Rob Lowe, Sam Elliott. I like Sam Elliott's part because he was the Marlboro man. But he says you never smoke marbles. He always just smoke the cools. And I had seen the movie before, I just didn't realize all the famous faces that were actually in it now. So, I would say the movie, the story's, the story's alright, the acting is good, the child actor, uh, Cameron Bright, is good. Now that I've seen it again, I had watched it once before, I don't know if I'm going to want to watch it again. At this point, I would say it's a delete. Thanks for watching Today We Review. Like I said, this was for Movie Club Strikes Back. If you want to check them out, click the annotation for their channel and they do a weekly hangout every Saturday which is a good time to watch. Feel free to comment below. You can reach me also on Twitter at MadLFan. Use hashtag today we review and uh, please feel free to leave suggestions for future films to watch or games to play for today we play. Thanks for watching. Come back soon.